being on The Voice, you know, it's life changing. Before, I was unemployed, looking for work, writing songs in my bedroom. Taking the first episode was the hardest. Writing up your lyrics, getting known as a nice. I was watching The Voice 12 months ago, and I said to Michael, you could go on there. And he says, no. She pushed me, so here I am now. I know you loved him. Two years ago on my birthday is the first time I heard him sing. I thought he was brilliant. But he didn't. He thought he was and he wasn't good enough. My mum is definitely my biggest fan. She's always sing this song, sing this song. If I go out to a karaoke or something, she always pushes me to get up. Drives me mad. But yeah, gotta love her. I just wanted everybody else to hear him, to know how good he is. To use uh, <laughs> Will's expression, it was fresh. <laughs> I gave Mike the fast pass because I felt he deserved it. And to, to give him confidence. Because I don't think he realised how good he is. Thank you so much. It means it means a lot to me, you know. No, the reason that, um, you know, that I saved you is because you sound different from anybody else on the show. You're going to be the first country singer, I feel, that this country has ever had. Never would have expected a lad from Salford, you know, to have Tom's team on, on The Voice. You know, sometimes I lie there at night and think, you know, it's, it doesn't seem real. Just to see you tonight. Singing When I Was Your Man, it's Mike! <laughs> Sing that, but it feels just a little bit bigger now. Our songs on the radio, it don't sound the same When our friends talk about you, all it does is just tear me down Because my heart breaks a little when I hear your name It all just sounds like ooh. Too young, too dumb to realize should have brought you flowers and held your hand. I should have gave you all my hours when I had the chance to take you to every party because all you wanted to do was dance. Now my baby's dancing, but she's dancing with another man. Millions of women watching at home going, you can hold my hand, you can buy me flowers, please. How was that for you? It was great, yeah, absolutely amazing. Was it everything you thought it was going to be? Definitely, yeah, I loved it. I loved Good. every minute of it. You did brilliantly. Let's go to the coaches. Jessie, let's come Firstly, to you first. I just want to say how amazing I think your hair looks longer. Yeah. I think you look very good tonight. Doesn't it? Yeah. I agree. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Get to the back of the queue. Of, that was a lot of... Room. Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, talking about long hair. Huh? I know, I'm like, I love your hair. I might grow mine back just like that. Um, I, I think the song choice was really, really good. I think it was really, really well thought through, yeah. Um, but I think if you're in the competition next week, I just want to 
again, I just said it before to Joseph, I just want to feel your performance a little more and feel the song a little more, that's all. It was a little kind of blank, but your voice sounded great. But just Thank work on, yeah, I'm just... Thank you, Tizzy. It's just uh, my opinion. But well, I think good. the vocal, it was great. That's all, yeah. OK, thank you. Thanks, Tizzy. <laughs> let's go to Tom. Now, Tom, he was your fast pass at the knockout rounds, and you did that because you wanted him to believe in himself. Is he starting to do that now? Yeah, I think so. I think he did a great job. And, and to take a song, a pop song, like that is, a Bruno Mars song, yeah. you know, and, yeah. and do something different with it, which, which Mike did. He made it a country song. You, you, you hear in that song that there, there's sort of country roots in there. That, uh, that you, wouldn't, you wouldn't have normally heard with somebody else singing it. Yeah. But Mike, I think, brought that, uh, brought that to life. And I think he was confident and he sounded great. OK, well, let's find out from Danny. Danny, what do you reckon? The UK's first country star? Could it be mine? I think it's... I, I genuinely... I, I agree with Jesse. Um, you know, I thought it was a fantastic song choice. I thought you were a little bit nervous, more nervous than I've heard you sound before. Um, but I, my advice would be that if, if you're going to be stagnant on stage, then let your face tell the story. I just felt it was just a little bit blank. But other than that, I thought it was really good. Thanks, well Danny. Well and done. Will, finally, let's come to you. I thought the sentiment of the song, you, 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 you brought exactly what the song needed. So, as far as what Danny said, I, I don't agree. I thought you were spectacular with that. But, to, Tom's, to what Tom said, as far as like taking that Bruno Mars song, that song sounds like a country, it's a country song, mm, and you and yeah. you really just put the glue on it yeah. to make it. I mean, that was really really fresh. And when you hear all the nasal things, when you hear the chains, that I mean, you sound country like a mug. I don't think you understand. <laughs> yeah, to you, man, that was yeah. fresh. Yeah. Yeah. 